welcome back to my channel that is such a cliche to say i feel like every video we look for people start out with welcome back to my channel because this is hardly a channel you know what i mean but i like to make videos because i like to share my love with of selena with you guys and i had previously made a video of my selena shirt collection because I already made a video of me showing all my CDs, cassettes, vinyls, and, um, the, you know, there's other memorabilia that I have, like magazines and books, um, Barbies, you know, merchandise, um, you know, like buttons and things like that, and, you know, at the time, you know, everything else that was being made, you know, when I was little, uh, the swap meets in El Paso, like, everything, like, clocks, um, beat up the posters of all kinds, like, all that, honestly, like, I, I don't bring with me, because right now I'm a college student, and I don't bring that in my apartment, because I never know if I'm gonna move the next day, and it's a bitch to move everything, but, um, so I like making videos of shirts, because that's something more easy to carry around when you move from apartments, so, and I, I take the music with me, because that's a, I, even though it's a bitch to carry around, too, I do like to listen to her music because I don't just stream. I listen to everything. But let me shut up. And I'm going to update my Selena shirt. So, I left off. Now I remember. I had to watch my other video. But, the last t-shirts I left off. Man, I got a lot since this. But, the last ones I got a Hot Topic, which was this one. This one, which is honestly my favorite one. I didn't think it was going to be my favorite one. And this one, which is one of my favorite ones. Because it's extra large. Alright. Let's do part two. So, once again, you know, I tend to order lots of stuff. Especially during the pandemic. But there's this one site that, for me, was like a treasure chest of Selena shirts. Not no more. Because, like, they don't have anything anymore. But, ugh, excuse me. Oh, excuse me. I had chilies. Sorry about that. Anyways. So I got three long sleeve shirts from Melrose. And yeah, I talk shit about long sleeves. And I just wanted to have them, you know, because like they're very nice. I have a t-shirt version of this one. Um, which is very nice. I like I love the t-shirt version and I actually like this one a lot as a long sleeve. I, I had a chance to wear it, I think like twice. Um but Again, I live in the, the desert southwest. And I'm, you know, thicker than a snicker. So, <laughs> yeah. I won't just leave it at that. And then, the second one is this one. I love this one. I actually love this one. I try to make myself wear this more than once. Even just to, like, be chilling at home. You know what I mean? And I love this one. I love it a lot. Um, because tie-dye is in. Uh, all of a sudden again. I think tie-dye has always been in, but I think now, like, it's making this, like, odd, like, resurgence. Like, everyone's into tie-dye, which I, I like. You know? So, I love this one. Now, this one, like, what the hell? is Brian. Brian. Look at that. But I like this design. Um, I love, I don't know, I just like this design. Um, I have a lot of shirts with this picture and I feel like now this picture is getting overused a lot but in this scenario like the way it did it like very like what's that one pop artist thing oh, I forgot but he did the whole uh, Campbell soup thing kind of like in this way anyway I like this shirt not as a long sleeve I already think I'm gonna actually make this into a tank shirt um, for the summer because I see myself, because I'm going to go back to playing tennis. So I definitely see myself, you know, this, playing in this for tennis. I'm going to cut the sleeves off for sure. So those three are from the Melrose. next two. I kind of grouped them together, even though I brought them at separate times. I ordered them online and from Rue 21. Um, there's this one, which I think is pretty cool. I like this uh, shirt a lot because I've always loved this photo shoot. I love this picture of her and this one. Those two are my favorite pictures of her since forever. And this one sold out. 
the first time I saw it. So, like, I was like, fuck, like, I'm never gonna see that again. I actually got the shirt. I actually got this shirt from my niece. So I, I wanted to own it, but again, it sold out, but it came back. So I got this one. And I love this shirt a lot because, again, I just love that picture of her and I just love this overall, like, design of this shirt. And I love white t-shirts with, you know, like, blue jeans. And there's this one. I like this one because I just like, like, this. I like the artwork in this. Like, good job on this shirt. And, uh, once again, I heard a picture and, you know, like, I just love these two shirts a lot. And I got these two shirts from Rufinus. I remember I did my first huge order with Two Productions website, and I, I only have two, but I believe I ordered like five t-shirts, and two I gave to my niece, and one to like my mother, um, but I kept these two. Um, I forgot why I gave the other ones away, but um, I really like this one. I like it a lot because the shirt reminds me of, I don't know, like, um... I don't know if y'all have seen, like, the t-shirts with, uh, Johnny Cash on them. And there's a lot with, like, I don't know, it just gives me off that old school vibe of her. And I just like the serious picture of her, and I like the bordering of her, and, you know, reminding us that she's the queen of Columbia, because she is. And then this one is very nice. Look at this one. And then it's my favorite picture of her. The hook, hell yeah! Look at that, look at, look at the detail on this, like, yeah. This one is very nice. I love to show this one off. Um, the weird part about this, I think this is meant for like skinny girls. I shouldn't say that. I think it's meant for girls. <laughs> like, I don't give a fuck. Um, because I think I misread the title and the title of the shirt was like dress shirt. And I was like, what does that mean? Mm, order. And it fits me well, it's just very long. So like, I don't know. I think it was specifically meant for some kind of like type of wearing. But like I said, I don't give a fuck. I'm gonna wear it and I've worn it before. So yeah, cube reduction. The next two I also ordered at separate times. Um, these two are from Hot Topic. Um, I got this one and these two right here. I think these are pretty cool. Um, I think um, this one I use for bed most of the time, like on my sleeping t shirt. And I actually do like the concept of this, but I do feel like a lot is going on, honestly, because I literally, when I ordered, I was all like, what's going on in this? Like, <laughs> you know, like, um, I like to use this picture of her, you know, this is, this is real cool, like, I love the picture because you, this is the one where she's like singing and she has like that leopard vest going on, um, but not only that, but we get this one too, which is another picture you, you have in you. So like, I'm, re I'm very reminding myself why I love this shirt because it's two pictures of her that are like not really used a lot. Um, then here's my favorite picture of her, which for some reason is put on her arm. Um, I don't know why they had to do that, but they did. But again, I, I get it, you know, this is art. Um, I'm all for though. But if you close to it, and her, you know, famous signature. But if you closely look, it took me a good second try to realize that these are arms or hands. I was like, the fuck? Like, that's kind of creepy. But then I realized that the, this is a picture, another picture. And it's from the um, 1993 Memorial Coliseum concert where she's like reaching out to the fans. That's what this picture is. There's like her face with the microphone and she's reaching out to like these fan, these arms, these hands. So I remember it was like, what am I looking at? Now I know what I'm looking at. So I can appreciate the shirt for the art. And then this one also too for the art. I like it for the art. Um, I ordered large. I tend to realize that if I really want to be comfortable in my shirts, to order an extra large. Because again, because then it's nika. But I, this looks like it was going to be nice and comfortable. And it's not. And I remember I the first time I wore it, I tore it. Yeah, and I'm not talented enough to know how to fix it. And I don't think I'm okay with it that it tore right there. Because I'm just going to make this into a tank top. Um, I don't think I'm gonna regret doing that because the shirt is still a little on hot topic, but, um, I think I'm gonna make this into a tank top. So, hot topic. I guess next find the group of three shirts. The, um, story with this is I have a co-worker for my job that, um, she would have spotting here in town. And I didn't even know we had spotting this year. 
But um, she sent me a Snapchat and they had Selena picture. Uh, they had Selena shirt. And I was all like, we have a spot meet? And I just remember I had time it out for the following weekend on the Sunday to go there. Unfortunately, I forget that 99% of the uh, vendors there don't take cards. <laughs> So I saw the shirts and I was like, fuck, like, I don't have cash. But luckily the, the, the guy was very cool with me. He was all like, oh my gosh, like you're a Selena fan. Like I'm gonna hold these for you. Like we pick. And I picked and then the following Sunday I went back and I bought them. And he actually gave me a pretty good deal. And I haven't gone back and that was like months ago. And he even said like, oh yeah, like I get these shirts from California. Like I should be getting more. Like especially since you're, I know you're gonna buy them. I'm like, yeah, I'm gonna come back every Sunday. I haven't been there, but I'm just gonna start off big. The first shirt that I saw on my friend's Snapchat, the one that made me run to them, is this one. Oh my god, like, the word, like, this is really nice. Just, I don't even have words. I'm getting goosebumps. Just look at this. <laughs> Anyways, there's that one, and then there's this one. Okay, so like, these are all extra large. I'm fine with that because they're very, very big t-shirts, and I'm fine with that because I'd rather be comfortable than uncomfortable. But, um, okay, so this one, I like it. Once again, it's that one picture I said that's gonna get very overused because... Yeah, anyway, um, I don't know what happened to this when I was washing it. Um, at first I was like, hell no, like, now I don't want it, but then my sister was all like, it gives you a really nice mole that, like, a lot of, like, I guess, like, models use, so I was like, eh, you're right, keep it. And I use it more as a speaker anyway, so, there's that one, and then, this one is pretty cool, too, because, like, I like to use one of her green shampoo pictures, and it is very, I think, like, an edgy rocker t-shirt, you know what I mean? Or kind of like I even see, like, you know, like, Polos or anything, like gangsters, like it's pretty, you know, this is very edgy. I like the shirt. So, if y'all have swap meets in your town, <laughs> go check them out because you will find treasure. I like all my Selena shirts and then I love them all, I wear them all, but there's, there's like a top five or top six that I have that I wear frequently to the point where I know I'm gonna like, you know, I'm gonna wear them out. Like the first, the very first shirt I have, like that one is dead. <laughs> cracked up but um for my birthday last year i treated myself to this shirt which i absolutely love and like i said i'm wearing it too much because the first thing i noticed is this is a clean shirt and i'm full of it mark oh gosh anyways <laughs> um i love this shirt a lot this shirt was hella expensive it was close to 40 dollars because it was from some weird ass site that like i just i don't even know what it's called but I paid for that money. It was my birthday money. It was my birthday shirt. So why not? And I just liked it because it's very... I love the art on this one. I don't have to even worry about that it's going to crack soon. Because that's the... It already is like that. So... And my favorite picture. There's this picture from the other shirt that I was talking about with the leopard print. But in full mode. And then there's this one. I really like how fierce she looks in this picture. Like she's just very fierce. So... I like this shirt a lot. If any of you guys have any tips on getting deodorant things out, please let me know in the comments. Please. My other favorite one was I just saying how great I love that mirror picture where she's so fierce. And then look at all these pictures in the background. Look at that. You don't see this a lot in pictures. So this particular picture. So you will see more of this too. Um, I love this shit a lot. I'm wearing a lot of some good nice deodorant things. So... These are in my top two, my top six favorites of signatures that I'm gonna overuse and overkill and over whatever. I didn't realize this was gonna be this long of a video. This is a lot of shirts. I didn't realize I got a lot since that last video. But, so this, these are my very latest finds. The other ones were like done months ago. But um, this is my very latest find uh, from Wally World, Walmart, playing Bill Hood. And I, you know, it's one of my, one of the people I follow on TikTok, actually, he shared this um, image of her. And I was like, they have these at Walmart? And also my friend who lives in Silver City 
if he watches this video, shout out to you because he also um, let me know that Walmart was having these t-shirts. And it's, I'll start it with this one. I've said I'm not a fan of long sleeves, but for some reason, this is for women, but again, I'm gonna look. I'm gonna wear this. I've worn this ring. You could tell it's so long. Like, it, this is a very comfortable t-shirt. Um, and it's extra large. I don't know, it's just very flowy. I love this. It, I don't feel like it's constraining of my fat or anything. Like, I love this shirt. It's, I went into sleep. I don't wear long sleeves to sleep. I did this with this one. And I just love this picture. I only have one, this picture already in a, in a white t-shirt. And I have it in this one and in a future shirt I just got. But get this one in extra large if you want to be comfy in. One thing I'm trying to wear more is white t-shirts. And I found, I'm, now I'm learning to make them extra large because I don't like tight white t-shirts, especially when it's cold. And I'm just gonna leave it there. But there's this one. Came with this other one that's already in my top six favorites. But I like, I do like this design. Um, I think, I don't know what happened there, but I like this design. Um, I love this photo shoot from the Entrame Mundo era. And I do like this. I believe I didn't like the, I didn't like it at the beginning because it wasn't that long sleeve yellow shirt. But now I have it in a white shirt, so I'm glad I got this as a white shirt. Now, this is my favorite. Look at this beauty. Look at this. Honestly, a long time ago when I was like a young man in high school, maybe even middle school, I think it was early high school. Um, Q Productions already had shirts up, and I remember one was this V-neck shirt, and it had this design from the BD BD Bomb Bomb Don't Get Back Is This Performance. And I remember I, that was my very first shirt I ordered with my own money, and I mean, it was my mom's money. And I remember when it came, the V-neck was so plunging, like it was definitely meant for girls. And I was at the time very non, very self-aware, like the way that I was, because it was high school. Who is? And I did not wear it out to public because it was plunging the vena. You could see my white chest and, you know, it was very, very, you know, like very fruity. You know, I was like a fruit. Now I wouldn't care. I would wear it. Hell yeah. But like, yeah, and I don't know where that shirt is. I feel bad. I do not know where that shirt went. But now I like, look at this. Red font. I just love everything. This shirt is perfect. I, this shirt is very perfect. So, literally no words, but yes, Wally World. I didn't mean for this video to be hella long, but it's a lot of shirts. Okay, this is my last group. I actually found these shirts yesterday. Yesterday. I went to the mall. I did not think I was going to find Selena shirts, but I did. The very first one was at Spencer's. Uh, the tag is still even on there. I haven't worn them. There's this one. What a cool design, huh? Again, tie-dye. Like, I love... This already looks like you, so I don't have to worry about when it actually starts to get, like, very overused. You know what I mean? This is very cool, and I love this photo shoot. This is a very badass t-shirt. It's very cute. And, like, the tie-dye design. Again, Spencer's. They only have large, so I had to... I had to get it. It's okay. The majority of my shirts are extra large. The next one. I walk to Route 21, which is next to each other. I walked in and literally all the staff knows me. They were all like, they're just, I said, wait, I waved to them and they all looked at me. And I remember the first thing was one of them was telling me about the buy one, get one, you know, that they always seem to have. And then the other girl went to the back and then the manager was all like, stay right there. And I was like, okay. And I was already starting to get anxiety. I was like, what could they, why? Like, what's going on? Like, do they have shirts? Right away, the girl who went to the back pulled out two of these. Look at this. Look at this. Oh my god. Isn't this perfect? I for sure got extra large. And I got another large one for my niece. Or... Look at how beautiful this is. Oh, go for me. Um, that's not a bug. That was a limp thing. But look at this. This is beautiful. Just in time for summer because it's always summer here in the Digital Southwest. Go to Route 21. You guys need this shirt. Oh, man. Still haven't worn them. I thought them yesterday. 
Now, I was aware of most of these shirts from either TikTok, from either online, because I, I check a lot on those stores to see if they have any, loose, any new Selena shirts. But the manager who told me to freeze, she just got up and I saw tie-dye in her hand. And I was all like, what shirt could that be? I don't remember seeing another Selena tie-dye shirt. Guys, look at this. I was jaw dropped when she gave this to me. The only downside was it was this one only. She was gonna give it to her relative, but she knew that how much I wanted it, so she gave it to me. And it's a large. And it's for girls. So I don't care. I wanna at least try to wear it once, and if it's tight, I'll sacrifice it to my niece. Because at least she'll wear it. But this is giving me a Sailor Moon look. It's like this is beautiful. And I was like. There's that one. And then there's one shirt I've been on the hunt for since forever from Spencer's. And it's so funny because I went to Spencer's first. Then I went to Rue. I was about to leave the mall. Then they called me saying like, we have the shirt that you want. Come back. And an extra large. I remember I was at the kiosk getting like Auntie Ani's pretzels and my phone clean. And I ran. I called them back and it was so hard to find. But I finally got it extra large and everything it's so beautiful I kind of want to wear it now but I already have this one on um, it was a great day yesterday for me finding all these Selena shirts um, yeah I'm happy very fortunate one last thing I want to show you guys um, was this sweatshirt that I got from I believe I not Route 21 I think it was Hot Topic and I have to get it because look how this is. I like this sweatshirt a lot, and I wore this a lot for the summer. Um, it's not, I mean, for the winter, it's not winter anymore here, but I wore it a lot. It's gonna be time to put it away soon, but I love this shirt. Like, look at this picture and look at everything. Look at the little strands. You can see that they're also like kind of like color manipulated or tie dyed. I mean, oh, excuse me. So. Yeah, that's the only sweater I got. Those are the only shoes I got. Uh, I mean, shirt. So, we'll see if I get any more. I know there's going to be a part three. I feel like I got enough shirts already. I, don't even, I didn't even count them. I don't know how many I have. And that doesn't include the shirts that I got, like, my friends for Christmas. And, you know, and it's a lot of friends I got Selena shirts for. And my, my family members. <laughs> Everybody, like, I bought a lot of Selena shirts. I for sure gave a lot of money to the Quintanilla family, but it's okay. I love these shirts, and we'll see what comes out. I hope more more good designs come out. So, and since a lot of Selena's new fans um, are very young, you know, kids or young teenagers, um, they're all on TikTok and I follow them a lot. So I'll put my TikTok in the description so you guys can follow me on there. I'm a huge twit, by the way, like very spaz. So there's the warning. But, um, yes, thank you guys for watching, and let's keep Selena's uh, memory alive, because you know what? She is alive, so.